Did you know there's a fortress buried 2,000 feet inside a mountain that was designed to house the entire U.S. military command during nuclear war? Cheyenne Mountain Complex, built between 1961 and 1966 at the height of the Cold War, consists of 15 three-story buildings mounted on enormous springs inside a hollowed-out granite mountain in Colorado, designed to absorb the shock waves from a 30-megaton nuclear explosion. The facility's entrance is protected by 25-ton blast doors that can seal within 20 seconds, creating a self-contained world with its own power plant, water supply, and air filtration systems capable of sustaining 1,100 personnel for weeks during nuclear Armageddon. Inside the mountain, the buildings housing North American Aerospace Defense Command, NORAD, and U.S. Strategic Command were constructed as separate structures with flexible connectors between them, allowing each building to move independently when mounted on springs, ingeniously solving the problem of how to protect sensitive equipment from devastating shock waves that would travel through the mountain during a nuclear strike. When fully operational during the Cold War, the facility processed data from a global network of sensors, tracking every aircraft and missile worldwide. With military personnel working in windowless rooms surrounded by granite walls, prepared to coordinate retaliatory strikes if Soviet nuclear missiles were detected heading toward North America. Though no longer America's primary command center, Cheyenne Mountain remains operational today as a backup facility, continuously maintained and staffed to ensure continuity of government in case modern threats like electromagnetic pulse weapons or cyber attacks disable more vulnerable command facilities.